The World Justice Project WJP is an international civil society organization with the stated mission of working to advance the rule of law around the world. The WJP works through three programs. Research and scholarship, the WJP Rule of Law Index, and engagement. WJP seeks to increase public awareness about the foundational importance of the rule of law, stimulate government reforms, and develop practical programs at the community level. It was founded by William H. Noycom in 2006 as a presidential initiative of the American Bar Association and with the support of 21 partners. The World Justice Project became an independent 501 non-profit organization in 2009. Its offices are located in Washington, D.C., and Seattle, Washington. WJP definition of rule of law The World Justice Project defines the rule of law system as one in which the following four universal principles are upheld. The government and its officials and agents are accountable under the law. The laws are clear, publicized, stable and fair, and protect fundamental rights, including the security of persons and property. The process by which the laws are enacted, administered, and enforced is accessible, efficient, and fair. Justice is delivered by competent, ethical, and independent representatives and neutrals who are of sufficient number, have adequate resources, and reflect the makeup of the communities they serve. Topic. Research and scholarship The World Justice Project supports research that examines the contributions of the rule of law to aspects of economic, political, and social development. The scholarship program is pursuing a research agenda studying the effectiveness of the rule of law in domains of social life, the interdependencies among the institutional components of the rule of law, and the causal mechanisms by which the rule of law affects economic and political life. WJP Rule of Law Index The World Justice Project Rule of Law Index is an quantitative assessment tool designed to offer a detailed and comprehensive picture of the extent to which countries adhere to the rule of law in practice. The index provides data on eight dimensions of the rule of law, limited government powers, absence of corruption, order and security, fundamental rights, open government, regulatory enforcement, civil justice, and criminal justice. These factors are further disaggregated into 44 indicators. Together, they provide a comprehensive picture of rule of law compliance. The index is typically published annually. The index rankings and scores are built from over 400 variables drawn from two new data sources, I a general population poll GPP, designed by the WJP and conducted by leading local polling companies using a probability sample of 1,000 respondents in the three largest cities of each country, and e a qualified Respondents Questionnaire QRQ, completed by in-country experts in civil and commercial law, criminal law, labor law, and public health. To date, over 97,000 people and 2,500 experts have been interviewed in 99 countries and jurisdictions. 
Adherence to the rule of law is assessed using 47 indicators organized around eight themes, constraints on government powers, absence of corruption, open government, fundamental rights, order and security, regulatory enforcement, civil justice, and criminal justice. In addition to country scores and rankings, the index also includes key global findings as well as an analysis of regional strengths, rule of law challenges, best and worst performers, and trends to watch. <laughs> WJP Rule of Law Index 2019 The list below shows the top 30 countries, territories and the full rankings are available for download on the WJP website. Engagement Since its founding in 2006, the WJP has helped give people in countries around the world greater understanding of the rule of law and with it, greater opportunities in nearly every part of their lives, from education, to health care, to property rights to fair and peaceful resolution of disputes. The WJP's engagement initiatives strive to make rule of law advancement as fundamental to the thinking and work of other professionals as it is to lawyers and judges. <laughs> World Justice Challenge The World Justice Challenge is an open competition designed to incubate practical, on-the-ground programs that advance the rule of law. Selected programs will be supported by Modest Seed Grants the typical size of a seed grant is $15,000 to $25,000 Connections to others in the WJP's global network Increased visibility through media and communication support World Justice Forum The World Justice Forum is the world's largest global multidisciplinary platform dedicated to advancing the rule of law. It is a global gathering at which prominent leaders from all parts of the world and a variety of disciplines come together to articulate how the rule of law affects their disciplines and regions and to develop collaborative actions to strengthen the rule of law. Since 2007, the WJP has held four World Justice Forums. The inaugural World Justice Forum was held in Vienna, Austria, on July 2–5, 2008. The World Justice Forum II took place on November 11–14, 2009, also in Vienna, Austria. The World Justice Forum III was held on June 20–23, 2011, in Barcelona, Spain. The World Justice Forum IV took place on July 8 to 11, 2013, in The Hague, Netherlands. Topic: <laughs> <laughs> Country level workshops. The World Justice Project convened a small task force of Tunisian leaders from business, government and civil society in Tunis, Tunisia, on May 28, 2012, to assess rule of law opportunities and challenges facing Tunisia during the ongoing reform process. 
The WJP worked closely with the World Federation of Engineering Organizations WFEO, the Arab Center for the Rule of Law and Integrity ACRLI, and the Hague Institute for the Internationalization of Law HEAL, in the planning and execution of the Tunisia Workshop. It produced a detailed report on the rule of law situation in Tunisia based on data from its rule of law index. The WJP is also considering organizing additional workshops in the future for countries undergoing transition. Topic: <laughs> US multidisciplinary workshops. The WJP supports multidisciplinary workshops aimed at strengthening the rule of law in the United States. State and local bar associations, law schools and other local leaders are sponsoring state-level multidisciplinary outreach meetings to form multidisciplinary partnerships to strengthen the rule of law at the state and community levels. Participants at these meetings have included business and community leaders, educators, health care professionals, judges, lawyers, government officials, and religious leaders. <laughs> Leadership Honorary Chairs The World Justice Project has the support of individuals representing a range of disciplines around the world. The Honorary Chairs of the World Justice Project are Hon. Madeleine Albright Hon. Giuliano Amato Hon. Robert Badinter Hon. James A. Baker III Cherie Blair Hon. Stephen G. Breyer Sharan Burrow David Byrne President Jimmy Carter Maria L. Katawi Hon. Hans Carell Hon. Ilario G. David Jr. Hernando de Soto Adama Dieng William H. Gates Sr. Hon. Ruth Bader Ginsburg Hon. Richard J. Goldstone Hon. Kunio Hamada Hon. Lee H. Hamilton Dr. Muhammad Ibrahim Hon. Hassan Boubacar Jallo Hon. Tasaduk Hussein Jilani Hon. Anthony M. Kennedy Hon. Beverly McLaughlin, P.C. Hon. George J. Mitchell John Edwin M. R. O. Z. Indra Nuri Hon. Sandra Day O'Connor Hon. Anna Palacio General Colin L. Powell Roy L. Prosterman Hon. Richard W. Riley Hon. Mary Robinson Hon. Peter Stoyanov Richard Trumka The Most Rev. Desmond Tutu Hon. Antonio Vitorino Paul A. Volker R.T. Hon. Lord Harry Wolf Hon. Andrew Young Topic <laughs> Board of Directors The World Justice Project's Board of Directors includes Sheikha Abdullah Al-Misnad 
Emil Constantinescu Ashraf Ghani William C. Hubbard Suet Fern Lee Mondley Macanya William H. Noycombe Ellen Gracie Northfleet James R. Silkenatha World Justice Project has the following board officers William C. Hubbard, Chairman of the Board William H. Noycombe, President and Chief Executive Officer Deborah Enix Ross, Vice President Suzanne E. Gilbert, Vice President James R. Silkenat, Director and Vice President Lawrence B. Bailey, Secretary and Treasurer Gerald W. Libby, General Counsel <laughs>